Join me today for a 10 minute chest and back workout using dumbbell weights. We're going to do 10 exercises with 45 seconds on and a 15 second rest. And before we get started, click subscribe and ring that bell for more videos created just for you. I'm excited, let's get started. To begin, think of your lower body as a tree trunk. So it's solid and firm. We're not going to move it. Hold your core in very tight. Have your hips straight. Bring your elbows parallel to your shoulders. And we're going to push forward and pull back. Great job, we've got a 15 second rest. Next up, we're going to do a bent over row targeting the back. Bend at the knees, engage your core, chest open and shoulders back and start rowing. This is how we lift in our day-to-day -day activity. So we're always going to stabilize our core first before we lift or pick up anything. And it's perfect for training our bodies to stay stronger for longer. Next up, we're going to work on shoulder definition. And as we do this exercise, we're going to exhale as we raise our arms, stop at shoulder height. And as you lift, imagine reaching your dumbbells out to the wall in front of you, and then try it without the reach and notice the difference. Next up, we've got the upright row to continue working our shoulders. So we're going to draw our weights up to our chest level, engage the core, and be mindful to keep your wrist below your elbow. If this 45 seconds is too easy for you, it's time to increase your weights. And if your body's swaying and you're starting to struggle, your weights are too heavy, so reduce them. The goal is to focus on your form and challenge yourself to do a little bit more than you think you can. Next up, we've got the bent over reverse row. We're going to bend at the knees, bend forward at the hips, place our palms facing outwards, and as you row, bring the dumbbell towards the waist. Hold your core in tight because that's going to protect your back. Feel your own strength. Keep going. You've got this.
job. And next up, we're going to do the alternate upright row. So stand with a straight back, roll your shoulders back and pull your elbow up to shoulder height. And you may be able to try increasing your weight slightly because we're only using the single arm. And ultimately here we're building strength and endurance and working hard to build muscle and burn fat. Next up, we've got the bent over dumbbell fly. So we're going to bend at the waist, take our arms out wide, and when we get to the top of the move, squeeze those shoulders. Now, a tip here is to use a lighter weight because we need to get through the 45 seconds. And if they're too heavy, you're not going to be able to lift your arms high enough. So this is really, really great for our posture and helping us stand upright. Keep going. Next up, we've got upright front raises. And again, for this move, use a lower weight. Bring your palms facing out and bring your weight up to shoulder height. Squeeze at the top of the move and engage your chest. Keep going, you're doing a great job. Great job, we are almost there. Next up, we're going to do a deadlift and these are amazing for building strength in the upper back, the lower back and all the way down to the glutes and the legs. Bend your knees just slightly and guide the dumbbells down your leg. And then as you come up, squeeze the glutes and push your hips forward on the top of the move. You can experiment with a heavier weight for this exercise because we're using our back and our glutes to lift and not our arms. It's time to drop those weights and for the next two exercises, we're going to fire up our arms. Do the very best you can to keep your arms up for the whole 45 seconds. If you need to drop them, do it for a quick second and then come back again. You've got this.
Get ready to increase the pace for the next 15 seconds. Look at you, you're fit, you're fabulous and you're full of life. You are amazing. Let me know in the comments below if you're feeling the burn. If you've still got some more energy, choose this video next and get some cardio on. And if you're finished for the day, congratulations. Make sure to stretch with this video next. Thank you so much for working out with me today and I'll see you tomorrow.